So Uber offers a cool feature for drivers and it's called Instant Pay. And with Instant Pay, you can cash out your earnings instantly up to five times a day. But have you ever run into an issue where your previous passengers have yet to pay for their rides and your Instant Pay um, request has been denied? Yeah, this seems ludicrous, but this actually happened to one of our readers. So this particular driver tried to cash out using Instant Pay one day and the driver app would not allow them to. So they then sent a support inquiry to Uber to figure out, to try and figure out what was happening. And here's the response he got from Uber. Um, they wrote, it appears that you currently don't have access to Instant Pay because there are a high number of trips that have not been paid for by riders. You will automatically be able to cash out again once you, once you take more trips that riders pay for. Your Instant Pay access should resume again as soon as these unpaid trips balance out. So long as you have more paid trips on your profile than unpaid trips, you'll be able to ca cash out once more. So quite frankly, this is ridiculous. Um, even if a passenger cannot pay for a ride after the fact, they should never have been allowed to, to request the ride in the first place. Um, as, as drivers for Uber, we should be able to drive with the peace of mind knowing that every ride request that we accept is going to be paid for. Um, and if a passenger has insufficient funds, Uber still needs to ensure that we as drivers are getting paid for that ride. And the only possible reasoning that I can think of for Uber giving this reason in their response to the this, this support inquiry is that maybe they're possibly trying to detect fraud on the driver. Uber does offer a few different payment options for riders, and one of those payment options is using a debit card. But what if a passenger doesn't ha has insufficient funds in their account? Then what happens? Um, I've heard multiple times from passengers, uh, they, they'll ask me, how much is this ride going to cost? Because they just deposited money into their account. And for passengers that do overdraft on their uh, checking account, a hold is placed on their on their Uber account until payment is reconciled, um, which is a concern that Uber should have, that, that this should never, never be a concern of drivers. Uber should always be the only one concerned with this. We should get paid for every ride that we give, every mile that we drive, every minute that we drive, we need to be paid for that. And for this particular situation, again, where this driver must have had a bunch of, of passengers that either had overdrafts or for some reason were unable to pay for their rides, um, this should not have been his concern whatsoever. He gave the rides on Uber's platform and Uber should have compensated him until they, they received payment from those, those passengers. It should have not been his concern at all. Instant pay should not have been shut off at all. And again, the only reason that Uber could have possibly had for this response is, is fraud detection on the driver's side. Now hopefully this is a one-off situation because this is a terrible look, um, but if any of you run into this instant pay issue where your passengers haven't paid for rides, um, leave a comment below and let us know. Uh, thanks again for watching. Please like, comment, or subscribe and drive safe. Thanks.